What is going on everybody? Your boy Unreliable Gamer here with some more Dying Light 2. Um, yeah, hopefully you're as excited as I am to hop right back into this playthrough. I'm having a blast with it and uh, yeah, it, the game like I said from when I originally played it has changed quite a bit. So uh, yeah, let's keep this short and sweet and let's get right to it. Alright, so uh, yeah in the last episode there we uh, we got our biomarker and hack on or whatever yeah he took off and uh yeah we got to meet him at the bazaar but for now i want to go over there and take out this uh or check out this windmill first uh alder windmill i believe okay all right let's get going here dark hollows forsaken stores okay good place to get loot <laughs> Oh, damn, what the hell's a howler doing out here? Damn, I thought they only come out during the night. Hmm. Like I said, been a while since I played, uh, or actually played this. So this playthrough is, you know, I'm going to be running into a lot of new things. Okay. And we got to get up top here. Let's take a look over here first. Here we go. We got, got some resources here. Some scraps. Thank you. Oh damn! We got ourselves a new weapon. Let me uh, let me take a look at that. Damn, fourteen. Change out the uh, broken shovel here. Well, we can dismantle these. Okay. We'll get rid of some of these here because a lot of them are really, uh, really shitty. Let this bill hook, we'll put that on. Um. Yeah, and another and a nailed stick. Okay, no, we're good with, uh, we're good with what we have on here. It's a badass knife. I think I gotta jump to that. Let's try my luck here. Okay, windmills and faction structures. Okay, it makes a safe zone. Nice, okay, and we get a UV light here as well. Nice, alright. We got a safe way down. Oh, here we go. Oh, damn. <laughs> Just because you got holes in your shoes doesn't mean you're poor. If you got no one to lean on, that's when you know you hit rock bottom. Hey, saw you up there. Thanks yeah. for turning on the windmill. Okay, um, let me take a look at the map here. I have these. Okay, yeah, I believe Hakon wants us to uh, head to the bazaar, so we're gonna go. Let's, uh, yeah, let's go there now. Might as well. Damn, I had it the hell down from here. Oh damn. 
We're gonna have to get out of here. Okay. Um. What the fuck is with the screaming? What the fuck? I'm viral. My goodness. Just trying to help this guy out. Okay, we got a fire resistance booster. Yeah, we're not really gonna need that right now. Take heed and bear witness, for this is the news of the last city standing. Okay. An update on the conflict with the renegade. Once upon a time, people only had those arrows. How was that? <laughs> what are these guys doing out here? In the middle of the damn day. It's kind of weird. Nice, we can get in here now that we got our uh, biomarker. going what a day no freaking way i can do it sometimes I what the hell are you talking money. about and you I'll can't do what thing. easy money what's the problem hey aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang man you were in luck there i could use some of that luck i'm alberto's apprentice not for long probably it's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. Okay, uh, yeah, what's this test about? What's this test about? Our goats. They're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence, energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I called this invention the electric fence. So what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see, as far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Alberto says they'll be there for sure, but it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. You have to go there at night. And the other option? Whatever's left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. Oh damn, I already have the parts he, uh, he needs. Um, sure, shit, why not? That was easy. <laughs> Looks like you're in luck after all. I have the parts you need on me. Are you serious? That's just fantastic. Heaven must have sent you. Yeah, here. I don't know how to thank you. One more thing. Could you help me set up my show? My installation's right outside the main entrance. Turn it on, please. I'll go get Alberto. 
wait till he sees it. Meet me by the goat pen then, near the wall. Okay, man. Uh, the spark of invention. All right, well. Hey, Dan. How's it been, kid? Got a taste for city life yet? Uh, I've been here and there. You know, the best parties always happen in the center. And that's where we're going. I have a plan for how to get there. I'll tell you everything on the spot. Meet me on the roof near the main metro station. Okay, so we got another quest. The only way out. Um, all right, well, let's... Uh, Hold on. Yeah, okay. Let's uh, finish this guy's quest here. It's apparently just out here, so... Everything all right? No, it's grilled. The goat is grilled. I'm such an idiot. B what happened? I must have overcalculated the voltage. See, he's useless. I'm sorry. I don't know how I could get it so wrong. I told you it would be a waste of time. Why? I don't think so. This is very, very. It has big, huge... You're saying it has potential. Potential, yes. It could be an effective weapon. A weapon? It's a ready formula. If you just use it on a weapon, it could raise your odds against turned creatures. The brave goat gave its life to science. There's dinner for everyone. And you? I take you as a... Uh, and pronounce you a... Uh, a... Uh, a... Uh, a... Craft master? Really? Oh my gosh, thank you. Thank you. We'll talk later. Come, Vincenzo. I can't thank you enough. Here, take this. If it's not strong enough, come around to my Craftmaster workshop. Sure, thanks. Just, uh, watch yourself out there, okay? No worries, friend. Damn, that was kind of weird. But it said, uh, he said this can give us, uh, help us with our weapon. Okay, weapon modifications. Okay, alright. Spark of an adventure. You see, can I craft that here? Or do I gotta go to like a crafting table? Yeah, I think so. Oh, okay, no, he gave us the uh the mod right here. Okay, so I'll put it on damn, I only got one electrical part. Yeah, I'll put it on the bill hook for now. Wait. Oh, fuck off. I put on the machete. Damn it. It doesn't matter. Whatever. Apparently there are Okay. Folks using Let me go take a look back in here. There's uh it looked like there was a few more quests in here. recognize me or are you allergic to making money listen pilgrim we can make a killing you and me you just need to get me some beets radishes parsnips there he is grab him ed he's a murderer what julian luke's been poisoned from the water you sold him devon says what but i don't sell water liar luke told me he got it from you whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now you're sure he didn't blame me after he started renting? Damn, maybe he's a little suspicious. Uh, yeah, what's your proof? Oh, well, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. 
When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast! Damn. Damn, dude, sounds like you're in a hell of a predicament. Wait, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. So, uh, maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of Villador, on Houndfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it, and half my flour is yours. Can you do that for me? I guess I could check it out. And there's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans, and... Can you go warn him? He's also on Hanfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, we got another side quest. Uh, so cheers. Tasty. Okay, let's have a look around here. No need to be shy. Okay, so this is the Craftmaster shop. You have hey, come yeah, to the okay. right place. Yeah, we don't got we don't got shit for money. Um, you get upgrade here. Oh shit, you can craft weapons. Yeah, okay. I don't I don't remember if that's new or what, but uh, yeah, we're still we're we're too broke to do that anyways. Okay. Damn. I swear it's freaking expensive to repair this shit. Um, okay, let's go check out somewhere else then. We got a shop here? Here we go. Yeah, merchant. Oh damn, nice weapons. Um Miscellaneous. Okay, sell all valuables. Uh with triangle there. Okay, we got a little bit of money now. But uh Damn. I think I'm gonna save it. Yeah, we'll save it for now. I'm sure we'll find some uh, some gear. Okay, let me take a quick look around here, see if there's anything else to pick up. If not, we're gonna get out of here. Okay. All right. Doesn't look like there's anything else here. So, um, oh, Cheers is actually level two side quest. I guess. Uh, yeah. I guess we'll do this one. We'll get over there and meet Hakon. Not quite sure what he. Uh, I think it was outside the metro tunnel station. I don't know. I'm not sure. But anyways, let's uh, let's head over there. Gotta go all the way around, went out the wrong damn, uh, wrong exit. Was that? Wait. Oh, it's right here. Oh, it's a nighttime story. 
the fuck? Damn, accepting this quest will fast forward you to the night. Okay, well for now we'll leave it alone, but yeah, we definitely will be uh we'll we'll be doing those. <laughs> Parkour challenges. I forgot about these. All right. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll pick some time and we'll do those as well. Oh, we got like a safe house thing over here. Oh, it might be another windmill. Damn. Okay, that'll give us a. Yeah, we'll give us a safe house. All right, well, let's go get this, and then we'll go to Hakon. He's, like, right here anyways. Damn, dude, I don't even know if I can make that jump. Oh, here we go. We'll go from here. Inhibitor container we need the detected. juice to turn on the UVs. Get on top and activate the wind, will ya? Lots of goodies here. Damn. How was that? Who the fuck is singing? Hey there. Rehearsing for the big night? Where did you come from, handsome? I heard you, uh, singing. Don't lie to Lola, sweet cheeks. Bet you thought someone was strangling a cat. No, not at all. I, I... See this neck? You shouldn't be able to. Usually, it's wrapped in the softest, most rare of mink stoles. Lola was the grand dame of the bazaar. But until reunited with her beloved Mink Stole, she is unfit to perform. But how will Lola dazzle anyone without her beloved Mink Stole? Without it, I can't hit the high notes. And you don't see Mink scampering about everywhere, do you? Now where is it? Earlier, a strong gust of wind ripped it from Lola's tender throat and carried it away. I saw it flapping from the scaffolding near the GRE quarantine at the intersection of Market and Horseshoe. Lola is powerless to retrieve it. Uh, I could. Would you? Lola could return to the bazaar to entertain, not frighten children like a lurking screamer. Well, we can't have that. No, indeed. Thank you, my knight in shining whatever it is that you're wearing i shall await you at the bazaar hurry my fans await damn wow that was kind of weird as well okay new side quest diva let me see where this uh where this one is here you see how far it is oh it's over here in houndfield or houndfield okay well we'll do that after hack on's quest here but uh, let's go get this wind, uh, windmill activated. See how the hell we're getting to the top of this one. Damn, that took all my stamina to do that. Wow. I have to do it on this one too. Yeah. 
Damn, dude, we need some more stamina. Wow. Okay, all right. Here we go. Okay, yeah. I'm not gonna watch this every time. I think we uh, we get the point. Ooh, we got a parkour level up. Let's uh, let's use that. Active landing. Okay, so oh nice, that allows us to roll and firm grip. Yeah, we're gonna grab this one. Okay, let's look for a way down now. Damn, before they did this, I think I should have looted it. Oh, nice. Got a traitor here. You guys do have some gear, but... Not really looking for medic. Not really ranger. Yeah, probably one-handed or two-handed weaponry, so... Okay, alright. Okay... Man, what the hell are these? Guess I should have took a look around with my binoculars. Let me see if I can see this here. Oh, it's just one of those military zones. Okay, all right, let's uh, let's head over there to hack on. What the hell is this? Damn, look at that guy. Military convoy. Okay, just, uh... Looks like there might be some good weapons and shit here, but damn, there is a shit ton of enemies. I don't think I'm equipped to deal with that, so... Hakon. Hey, you're a better climber than one crazy girl I used to know. <laughs> she was something. She even wanted to climb the tallest building in the city. The VNC Tower. <laughs> was she one of your wives? Almost. Too hot-tempered, even for my tastes. What about this passage to the center? Right. Look, from this roof you can clearly see the Peacekeeper's base. Wait, you... Brought me here to take a look at the peacekeepers? The PK are your ticket to the center. I told you the only way to get there is through the metal tunnels. I'll go inside and draw their attention away from the platform. Then you enter the metro technical station. There's an airlock there. We'll take it together to the central loop. We can't just ask them to let me through? No chance. Right now, each new face they see belongs to a suspect in their commander's murder. They know me. I trade with them sometimes. I deliver lamps from the girls, or goods from dark zones. There might be a few infected there. Nothing a pilgrim can't handle, though. When you get to the main station, let me know. Now you better get some sleep. You'll head out at night, when there's less infected in the tunnels. Really, man? Fox, we gotta do this shit at night? Oh, come on, Hakon, you know damn well I don't want to do that. Damn, man. <clears throat> Huh? What the fuck is that? Hakon, there's a creature I haven't seen before. What does it look like? Not a, not a big one. Extremely fast. Probably a bolter. You can find some interesting stuff on them. But catching one requires serious hunting skills. Now is not the best time for this, Aiden. Head for the tunnels. Okay. Oh boy. Um, anything in here? Oh, we got a tape here. A uh, collectible. Okay. All right. Well. Oh, 
Well, the tunnels are they're literally right here. Actually, let me grab all this shit first. Okay, all right. Tunnels are right there. Damn, you got a bunch of infected down there. Oh shit. Okay, we'll avoid them. Um, damn, I don't know how the hell I'm gonna get these guys away from here. I don't want to use the bomb. It's going to make a ton of noise. Um, okay. Yeah, we're going to have to kill him. Damn. Damn, we got no stamina. Yeah, the main thing here is I just want to keep it quiet. Oh, yeah. Let me grab some shit from these guys. Thank you. Okay, let's get in here. Oh, damn. Wow. That was pretty lucky. Damn, you know what I noticed? What the fuck was that? Um. Okay, I'm just trying to see how to get to the UV shrooms here. Okay. Alright, we're good. Let's go. Damn, dude. What the fuck, hack on? Good, I don't see anybody here, so some valuables. Alright, then let's keep it moving. some sleepers in here. Oh shit. One of those dudes walking around over here too. Okay, got ourselves to level up. Um, air kick. Ooh, a perfect dodge. Okay, we'll grab that. Ready, eh? Grab these. Okay, they don't they don't heal that much though. I just gotta hurry up and get through this here. Oh shit, dude. Damn. Fucking light. Yeah, gotta be careful with that. Um, I wonder if I can stealth kill those guys. Damn, dude, it's so fucking dark. Oh, you can. Nice. Okay. Oh boy, that was freaking close. Okay, let's keep going here. I'm in the tunnel. Okay, now watch out for the infected. There might be a few, 
or a few dozen. I'm already in the BK base. I'll throw a UV flare through the vent, and you'll see how to get to the main station. Alright, well, I guess we're just gonna try and sneak by these guys here. No point in fucking with them. Damn, dude, I need something. Come on. These UV shrooms kind of suck. Thank you. Oh, shit, dude, really? So we got a lock pick it, of course. Okay. Oh boy. Come on. Damn, the combat is so satisfying, man. Okay. Wait, there was a uh, chest over here. Let me grab this. Damn, should have went the other way. Here we go. Ooh. I would gladly take that. Um, let me put that bad boy on. Got ourselves a brand new, uh, brand new machete. Nice. Dude, come on. Again? I don't, I don't, I don't got the fucking immunity for this, man. That's all I got for now. Dude, what the fuck are you doing up? What the hell? Damn, those executions, man. Oh, dude. What is going on here? Damn. Probably gonna see me. I'm probably gonna have to kill him, but that's okay. Oh no. Come on. That's alright. Oh damn, you can actually go in here? Oh dang. Problem is, just man, it is dark now. I don't remember it being this dark, but damn, dude, really? Oh shit! Shit. Oh, come on. Where'd the thing go? How come I can't read him now? There's no way he got all the way over there that quick. Damn. Oh, 
Come on, man. Oh, my goodness. We're just going to keep moving here. Fuck it. Shit. Another one of these guys. Let's see if he comes this way and turns back around. There he comes. Oh shit. Okay, all right. They grab us in this bag and we get the hell out of here. Looks like we're going the right way, so. <coughs> Damn, dude. Oh, shit. I did not know that zombie was there. What the fuck's up with this body, dude? Chill out. Oh, we got a chest over here, too. Um. Oh, shit. A couple of zombies. I would go get it, but, um. And we don't have that much, uh, UV shrooms, so I don't want to take any longer than I need to here. Actually, I might be able to go over there and get it. We'll see. I'll give it a shot here. No, not this way. Let's try the other way. Here we go. Ooh. Mechanic's hammer. Let me take a quick peek at that. Um, yeah, I'm 19. Um, yeah, we'll take out the bat for now. Needs to be repaired anyways. got some decoys. What do you put them on? How do you use them? Damn. Holy shit. Oh, we don't need to do that. I don't want to waste them here if I don't have to. If I can just sneak around, we'll just, uh, we'll save the decoys. Here we go, finally. I got to the flare. Look around. Tunnel to the main station should be well lit. I've already lured the guards upstairs. I'll chat them up while you get inside. Okay. Yeah, I don't know how to use it. Maybe it's L2 or uh because yeah, L one's the block. I don't know. Oh yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Oh shit. Dude, no way. Okay, go. Oh shit. What the fuck is that? Hakon? There's a situation here. Hakon? Oh shit, it brought these guys. Okay, we gotta get rid of the spitter, the bolter, or whatever. Really? Okay, we got rid of him. Let's 
get rid of these. Gotta get rid of these other assholes here. Damn, that shit is so satisfying. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now let's see if we can get in here. Come on. There it is. Yeah, I can hear Hakon out there distracting him. Um. <laughs> Damn. Hakon, I'm inside. Five packs. Think about it. And I'll be right back. What the fuck, man? Okay, we're gonna keep it moving then. I'm on the platform. Open the airlock. I'll be there in a second. Uh, okay. The airlock's over there. I don't want to take a look around. This place looks like it might be loaded with resources, though. Yeah, just let me take a quick look around here. Yeah, I don't think we got anything down here. Okay, all right. That plan didn't work, clearly. Fucking hack on. Where did he come from? He was wandering through the tunnels. Fucking bizarre riffraff. More like a renegade spy. Hmm. Doesn't look like a renegade. He's awake. What were you doing at our base? I'm only trying to get to the city center. The center? <laughs> the tunnel's gonna be closed until you hand over Lucas's killers. Bizarre scum. How is it that you lot saw nothing, heard nothing? And you managed to forget about the ban on passage. Maybe we'll start punishing you by cutting off your hands. That would improve your memory, huh? What were you doing four days ago? I'm a pilgrim. Four days ago, I was a hundred kilometers away. Enough, Anderson. We need the truth. And you won't get it through coercion. But Commander Lucas, Lucas always is said... dead. And now I'm in command. You've read the reports. A pilgrim appeared in the bazaar yesterday. It looks like he's not lying. Leave us, Sergeant. I want to talk to him alone.
Where did you come from? From Crossdale River. That's over 1,500 kilometers from here. It's actually more than 2,000. The freeway bridges collapsed. There are no straight paths. And you've managed to make it so far away. Impressive. What's it like out there these days? Oh, damn. Uh, why do you think I why do you think I killed anyone? When was the last time you were outside the city? Yeah, we'll just uh, we'll go with this one here. Outlands are dangerous. What's it like outside the walls? You never know where danger is going to come from. Always new territories, new threats. And you came here to take shelter. I came here because I'm looking for someone. And a lot of people are said to have survived in Villador. You're looking for someone. Hmm, well maybe I can help you, but not for free. I'm used to trading. What do you need? No nonsense. That's good. The tunnel will be closed until I find our commander's murderer. Commander Lucas. His body was found in the bazaar. Horribly mutilated. The people of the bazaar aren't making this easy. They're proud and loyal. They refuse to turn anyone in. But command has lost its patience. I have orders from the top, Pilgrim. If the inhabitants of Old Vilador continue to revolt, our army will come here and burn the bazaar to the ground. Now, I'd rather avoid that. And what do you need from me? Lucas had a weapon. A rare set of brass knuckles called the Lazarus. This is the key to finding the killer. If you learn anything about the Lazarus, tell me, and I will most certainly return the favor. It's worth a lot. And we didn't find it on his body. I think someone from the bazaar may have appropriated it. Damn. Yeah, I mean, I guess I can try. I honestly, I really don't have a choice, considering where I am right now. So if I find that weapon, you'll let me through to the center? It's not that easy. Vilador suffered much. First, it was isolated from the outside world because of infection. Then the walls became its salvation. The people here learned not to trust easily. I won't open the passage until I've caught the killer. But if you can find the Lazarus, I'll remember that. You'll be the first one through once justice is done. Sounds as if I have no other choice. I'll try. Look around. Ask people. And don't come back empty-handed. Good luck. Okay, so it looks like you guys are just gonna let me go, which is great. Um, okay, we got a new safe zone unlocked, main terminal station. Yeah, some areas in this game are pretty damn dark now. And, uh, I didn't know you can turn on your flashlight during, you know, when you're talking to an NPC and shit, so next time I'm gonna make sure to do that if it gets dark. Okay. Another safe house here. I think that's another windmill. Um, there's a diva one. Same one there. Oh, damn. I, got your six. I haven't seen a uniform like yours before. I'm a carrier. A carrier? What's that? I belong to the Carrier's Guild. I'm one of many. If there are so many of you, why haven't I seen your uniform before? We're discreet. We're entrusted with valuable information and therefore keep a low profile. Now your profile isn't so low right now. Indeed. Our headquarters are located in the center, and the only passage right now goes through the subway tunnels. The peacekeepers control the passage and aren't letting anyone in or out of the center right now. Until they do, I'm stranded. That sucks, especially since I'm in need of some information. I can't help you. We have a strict code of confidentiality. Only our guild master would be authorized to share information. And then he's the one I should talk to. 
Any other ways I can get into the center? Not that I'm aware of. On the surface, the border of the center is a no-man's land. It was devastated in a chemical attack, cutting this district off from the center. The air and ground are poison. Only the most freakish of monsters can survive there. Damn. Well, I'll have to find a way. Somehow. Good luck. Damn, dude, you aren't really any help at all. Hey, hack on. Are you there? Aiden, buddy. Could you're alive. Yeah, I got caught and questioned. Good. They didn't kill you. Meet me outside. Wait, okay, I thought it was dark out. I was about to say. I could have swore we just did that throughout the night. Otherwise, there will be a rebellion. Help us in the investigation. We'll help you with the bandits. I told you already. Nobody in the bazaar had anything to do with Lucas's death. Oh, they're talking about their time? commander's death if here. Everyone is so innocent, then there'd be nothing to hide. Okay, so we got a workbench here. Um, we got a trader here as well. You see what they have. Step right up. Step right up. Got plenty you like. Been on the lookout for that. Yeah, see, even uh, even some tank gear wouldn't be bad. Oh, the brawler one is what I want though. That is uh. Yeah, one-handed. Yeah, for one-handed weapons here. Damn. No, if I should. You know, yeah, we'll buy this piece here. Why not? Quality, didn't I tell you? Tell everyone you. Should automatically put it on, I believe. Yeah. Um. No, about me. Okay. All right. Let's see where we're going now. Uh, the only way out. We gotta talk to Hack on. And we got these side quests. Okay, all right, let's get out of here and talk to Hack on Annie. I believe he's waiting hey for there. us. Come on, I'm on the roof next to the metro. How many notches you got on your belt? <laughs> so, what did they want from you? Ader said he might let me through to the center, if I help him. What? What are you supposed to help him with? He wants me to find Lucas's weapon, the Lazarus. Went missing from the crime scene. He believes finding it will help find the killer. The Lazarus, huh? Fancy set of brass knuckles, right? I know a guy who trades stolen goods and other shit he gets from thieves. A fence? Part-time fence, full-time scammer, an artless one, too. He's got half the city after him for debt right now. If anyone in Villador is fool enough to buy a peacekeeper weapon, it would be him. And what's his name? Hubert Carbatos, also known as Half-Ass Hubie. Every day he sets up shop in the nearby windmill and waits for customers. Probably selling booze and weed to the PKs. If you want to find the Lazarus, talk with Hubie. I'll chase down some other leads. Okay, let's keep in touch. All right, well, we had to go find, what do you, what do you call him? Half-assed Hubie? <laughs> okay, um, let's take a quick look here where we're going. Okay, we're in a different spot of the map here, nice. And we got a windmill over here too. So, uh, yeah, we'll get the windmill and we'll go, uh, we'll go, we'll go find Hubie. Hubert, or whatever his name is. Hey, Oak Windmill. Okay, damn. Oh, Hubert's at the top of this. Okay, before I do that, I want to loot down here first, because when we activate this windmill, pretty sure you lose these uh, lootables right here. ourselves a, a new helmet I believe yeah we did 
Oh, brawler too, nice. Good, good. Someone sneaking up on me. You Hubert? No, not me. I'm waiting for Hubie too. So get in line. Got it. You know when I'll be here? Maybe in an hour. Maybe two. You never know with old half assed That said, he's got the best moonshine. So, worth the wait. Uh, nothing to do but wait, I guess. Oh, come on, really? I was about to say, I could have activated this windmill while we were waiting, but... Whatever. Hey. You Hubert? Who's asking? A customer. I want to buy something. Hey, you're that stranger they wanted to hang, aren't you? Hey! Hubie! You got a special customer! It's that pilgrim from the bazaar! W wait I just want to buy something! So, that was Hubie, wasn't it? Yep. Apparently had an urgent appointment with another customer. Man, you yeah, asshole. Sure. Are you chasing someone right now? Hack on. Okay, I gotta catch away. this fool. Come on. Nah, sounds like Hubie. Oh, wait a sec. I see him. Asshole's running to the northeast. Faster, Aiden. You almost got him. Yeah, man. I love the freaking parkour in this game. Come on. Oh, shit. Are those fucking bandits, man? Damn, fuck them. Oh, boy. Damn, I just ran by a bunch of bandits. What the fuck? Hack on. He's not here. Where the hell he go? He's climbing to the roof. Oh, come on, really? Is it up here? Oh, it is. Damn. Um, okay. Damn, dude. I don't really have the stamina to be doing this, and I would have liked to activate that damn windmill, but... Ah, damn. Lost him. But he's got to be on that rooftop, Aiden. Find damn, him. dude. Come on. Why do you gotta jump? That's fucking weird. Here we go. Oh, boy. Come on. That was close. Hubert! I just want to talk! <laughs> don't hurt me! I don't know anything! About what? I haven't asked you anything yet. I don't know anything about anything, I swear! I'm told that you're a fence, hmm? A fence? No way! A reseller, maybe, but... I'm looking for the Lazarus. Yeah, I used to belong to Lucas, the late PK commander. And don't try to tell me you don't know who Lucas is. Well, then I won't. You know anything about the Lazarus? Are you kidding me? Even if I'd been offered those brass knuckles, I would have refused. I'm not an idiot. That weapon is way too hot. Yeah, dude, then why the hell did you run? Uh, how do you know the Lazarus is a set of brass knuckles? How did you know the Lazarus is a set of brass knuckles, hmm? I didn't say that. Come on, everyone knew about Lucas's little love glove. He was always showing it off. If anyone thought I had him, they might also think I killed Lucas, which is bullshit. But someone tried to sell it to you, right? 
I told you, I... Okay, fine. Maybe someone did, but Please. I can't say who. Let me go. Client confidentiality. Stop fucking around. Tell me or I... Her name is Maya. I met her in the tenement building at Meatpacking Square, near the old butcher shop. But I don't know anything else. Leave me alone. It overlooks some army barracks or some shit. All right, I can find that. Okay, all right. So Hubert, or Hubie, whatever, he doesn't have them. Hey, hack on. Hubert said someone tried to sell him the Lazarus. Do you know Amaya? No. Strange, because I thought I knew all the women here. I'm headed to Meatpacking Square. Meatpacking Square. It's a fucked up place. There are some barracks there. The army set up in 23 when shit went south. She's supposed to be in one of the buildings that overlook them. Okay. Stay in touch, bro. Damn. Okay, well, we gotta look for Maya. It's over this way. Yeah, we have another windmill here. Okay. There we go. Um, yeah, we got this one too, but we fucking ran away from it. It's all the way the hell back there. The oak one. Um, okay, so let me take a look on the map here. Make sure I can get this one. Okay, we'll grab this windmill then. And then, um, yeah, we'll head over here and look for, look for Maya. Damn, we gotta get off this tall ass building, man. Damn, I don't know if I can make that. Fuck it. Oh, yeah. the same as last time we're gonna loot over here real quick and then uh, yeah we're gonna activate it some scrap thank you oh really I got some sweatpants nice Looks like it's starting to get dark, too. They build a settlement up here. We're gonna skip this. Okay, ma maple windmill completed. Oh damn! Wait, you don't loot the or you don't you don't lose these? Nice. I fucking loot them twice. Sell some new gloves here. Um, yeah, you take these off. These are really bad. There we go. Okay, nice. We're actually getting some gear now. I am not mad at that. Okay, yeah, Maya's isn't too far. 1742. One hour until nightfall. Um, I mean, since we're here, we could rest up. I think we can sleep... No, oh, you can only wait till night. Fuck it, okay. Well, we'll head over there and look for Maya then. Might as well. Oh, damn. Oh, this is one of those dark zones. Oh, damn. Yeah, we won't do that during the day. We don't want to mess with that. 
Look at these guys. Oh, what the fuck? Oh shit. Oh shit. I just want to heal up real quick. Okay, I'm not even sure what that was. THV chemicals? Damn. Okay, well, we got rid of these guys. That's yeah, garbage. You could probably dismantle this stuff, though. level are we? We didn't level up or anything. No, we're still level one. Okay, all right, let's get going. Oh, nice. They got UV lights around these things? Nice. Kind of like a safe spot. Damn, we got another windmill here. You know what? Before we do this, so you don't have to do it at night, let me go activate this windmill. And then we'll, uh... Should be able to sleep by then. Until morning. See if I can actually get up this one. Yeah, we just need uh, 100 stamina. Okay. Oh, damn. Damn, this one is quick. You know what? Now, when it goes up and down one more time. I'm gonna hop on this one. Damn, that was freaking close. There we go. Made ourselves another windmill. Nice. He's given a good amount of parkour XP as well. Oh, a nailed stick. Okay, um. It should be. This is wait until night still? Night is coming. Okay, well, we're gonna sleep and then we'll sleep again then, whatever.
Okay. We're good to go. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go look for Maya here. Inhibitor container detected. I keep saying that inhibitor container de uh, detected. Hmm. Shit. Of course it's dark. The fuck is going on? Damn. Damn, dude. What the heck, man? Okay, we are going up there. Indeed. What is this? Oh, nice. One of these. We got inhibitors in here. Beautiful. Ooh, leather guards? Damn, dude. That shit sounds crazy. Um, here we go. Perfect. Wait, what are the bonuses on this? Damn, those are, those are pretty damn good. Okay. What the fuck? A collectible. Okay. Hey kids, um, I'm looking for a woman named Maya. <laughs> it was so funny. Maya ain't a grown up. She's just a plain old girl. Hold on. You were the one trying to sell a PK weapon to Hubert? Yeah, but the jerk didn't want it. Got all freaked out and chased me away. Yeah, I mean, I could ask her to give it to me, but damn, I can't believe it was just the kid. Maya, I need that weapon. It's very important. You expect me to just hand that brass who's what's it over? Are you nuts? The who's what's it's real name is the Lazarus, and it belonged to an important PK. We might have a war if I don't return it. You could help us find a murderer. Okay, I'll give you this stupid thing, but for 500... What? I don't even think I have that. You know what? Um, I mean, I don't want to be an asshole, too. I mean, everybody's got to make a living, right? Um, yeah, we'll just we'll negotiate. That's a lot of money, kid. Of course it is. Life's damn expensive. I have to buy water and a marker for my brother. He's turning 12 soon, you know. I can give you 10, and that's my last offer. Deal! Nobody wanted to buy it anyway. Damn, dude, it went from 500 to 10. <laughs> wow. Damn. Okay. So we, yeah. Okay, so we, wait, we did, uh, so she gave us the brass knuckles or the knuckles or whatever. Hey, Akon. I have the Lazarus. Cool. Get your ass to Eto with it. It'll make the perfect birthday present for him. Though I have no idea when that prick was born. I'll be near Metro Station. Okay. Okay. All right. So we gotta get back to Ator here and uh, give these knuckles to him. Let's see if we can uh, fast travel. Should be able to. Oh shit! What is this? We got another windmill here. What is this? Oh, a quarantine quarantine building. Nice place where we can get some inhibitors. But uh yeah, it's best to go there at uh at night, so Okay, let's go to let's go over to Ator here. Wait, can we fast travel? I don't think we can. No track. I don't know, maybe it's because I chose hard difficulty or something. I could have swore you were able to tra fast travel before. Um, man, you can't fast travel here either. Damn. 
Okay, all right, let's uh, let's get back to Ator. Then we're gonna have to move on. We're gonna have to go by foot then. Wait, what the fuck? It won't be easy to kill me, so let me go. How? It can't be. You shit me. Still glad you enlisted, punk. Damn. Alright, I guess we could help him. Let's get down there and help him. That's so right. Anybody else? You hear asshole. Ooh. Oh damn. What the fuck? This guy's armored. Damn. Oh. Yo, that was weird. I never seen a fully armored uh Damn. Really dude. All the, all the noise this guy is making. I think that's it. Oh, this guy's still here. Alright. Damn, buddy. Alright, you are good to go. Nice. You get a little bit of XP for that, too. Thought my squad would save me. Uh, poison the resistance booster. Damn. <laughs> Damn. A dirty cleaver. Yeah, I'm just gonna take everything for now. Uh, pretty sure it's broken. Well, it looked broken. Excuse me, coming through. Oh shit, there's actually a couple of zombies up here. Oh damn, I actually fell down. Don't try and uh, dodge when you got no stamina. Damn, dude. I should actually make a uh, couple more med kits anyways. What else we got here? Oh, some lavender. We'll get some more lavender. Oh no, chamomile. Okay, let me make a few more med kits here. That's weird though, I could have swore there's there's gotta be a way to fast travel. Um I don't know, maybe it's just the metro stations that you can fast travel from. Not sure if I'm remembering correctly, but let me uh Yeah, we got a bunch of shit here. Yeah, I'm gonna break down some of this stuff.
There we go, and we'll break down this one. Yeah, the other stuff I think I might be able to make some money off of, I'm not sure. Where's the, uh, let's go take a look at this shop. I want to see if I'm able to sell these weapons. Primo PK goods right here. What'll it be? Damn, I can definitely buy weapons. Oh, I can. Yo, they don't sell for shit though. One coin? Oh, well, that's pointless, man. There's no point in selling those. You might as well just break them down. Damn. Get some medic gloves here. No, we'll stick to, uh, stick with these ones though. They're brawler. Okay, Remember, damn. PK's got the best shit. Does it change anything? Freaks me out by things like that. All right, Ator, we got your freaking gauntlets or gloves or knuckles or whatever. Brass knuckles. The pilgrim has returned. I hope not empty handed. I found the Lazarus. I'll be damned. I was right that you could open doors we couldn't. Where's the fucker who had him? In Meatpacking Square. You didn't let him go, did you? That could have been the murderer. Uh, a girl had him. She's 10 or something. She didn't kill him, just looted the corpse. Stop. We'll get back to this later. Leave us. Um, yeah, I don't really care about his tattoo. Uh, yeah, let's see if he can actually get me to the damn center. I did what you wanted. It's your turn. Get me to the center. Opening the tunnel to the central loop is beyond my pay grade, Pilgrim. Command wants me to find the killer. Ader, you promised! Cool down, Pilgrim. I keep my promises. First, take this. Token of gratitude. <laughs> Ader, I have to get to the center, get it? You're looking for someone, right? I want to go to the central loop too. My wife and kids are there, and I can't protect them when I'm stuck here. The tunnel will open when I find the killer. Is that clear? You can help me, or you can wait until I find him myself. I see traces of blood on the Lazarus's blades. Lucas managed to wound his killer before he died. Bastard's got to have a nasty gash. If you find him, you'll not only help me, you'll be helping yourself. <sighs> okay. Do you have any suspects? The commander was murdered in the bazaar. There had to be someone from there. Okay, I guess we don't have a choice. I mean, he seems to be the only one who can get us to the center. I'll try to find Lucas's killer. Splendid. That's your ticket to the center. Head back to the bazaar. Is there anything else I should know before I go? Yes, as a matter of fact. But this is totally hush-hush. Word of this cannot get out. Sounds serious. Whoever killed Lucas took a little trophy, carved his tattoo right out of his bloody arm. They cut into his corpse? That is seriously fucked up. Yeah, seriously. Men found out Lucas was desecrated like that, they'd lose their shit. And it would be total war. I'm telling you this, because if you find that little... trophy, then you found the sick fuck who killed Lucas. Got it. I'll head out right now. Damn. Okay. So we gotta really, we gotta help him find the damn killer before we can do anything here. Um... Aiden, still alive? Worried about me, are you? Of course. I have high hopes for you, Aiden. Meet me outside. Damn. Okay. Oh, hack on to right here. Alright, well, let's talk to him. Aiden wants me to find Lucas's murderer. Only then will he help me get to the center. Not doing his dirty work. Well, that's no surprise. He told me to start with the bazaar. Oh, figures. PK and the bazaar really hate each other. Only two people matter at the bazaar. One is that overblown preacher, Carl. I know that. Who else is there? Sophie, his right hand. 
She has a way with the bazaar's more rebellious souls. Helps him keep control. There's also Dodger, a local gangster. He knows what's going on, and about the bandits led by Joe. But they're afraid of the PK. Okay, I'll talk to Sophie and you look into Carl, unless... Do you prefer the girl? Sophie? Uh, she's not really my type, you know? And headstrong. She's... you'll see. Alright, so it looks like we are gonna be going back to the bazaar. Okay, question Sophie about Lucas. Let me just make sure we're going the right way here. Oh, we're back here. You know what? Let's go, let's go grab this windmill. I don't know. I think this is a safe house, but I don't think it's a windmill. We got a few side quests, or at least one or two we could take care of, too. But, um... Oh, we... This... Oh, this, the metro station requires electricity, so... I could have swore there's a fast travel button. I don't know. Whatever. Let's go get this windmill. least I could do is go the the right damn uh, the right damn way. Damn. This guy's are handling business. Oh. Damn, look at this guy. Wish we had a power attack. Okay, these guys don't need help. Let's keep going now. Yeah, all right. Let's uh, let's get up here. I like these kind of like some jumping puzzles type deal back here with this idiot. Ourselves another one done. There we go. Oh shit, we got a quest giver over there too. A PK settlement. Damn. There's a lot of unlocks there. Look at this place. That's pretty cool. These guys really built it up. Um, I wonder what they got here. Oh, they do have a vendor. Yeah, you got the same old shit. This rocks. Okay. Um, yeah, so it looks like we're going to have to travel back to the bazaar. It's actually not that far, though, so... The hell was that? Damn. I want to take a look at this encounter over here. Oh, wow. Thank you. down here. Damn, I think this dude just killed him. Hold on. Oh shit, dude. I don't have any throwing, um... Really, dude? 
There we go. Oh shit, really? Okay, well we caught him. Let's get rid of these guys here so we can loot this stuff. Damn. It's fucking virals, man. Let's get up here. Damn, that guy's got armor on. Come on, let's go. I don't know what they're doing out here, man, but maybe it's the event. I don't know, but. Damn. I don't even know what the hell happened. I just want this loot, guys. Damn. What the heck, man? I can't even hurt this guy. Okay, alright, well, let's loot this guy and get the hell out of here. Finally. What the hell? I don't know, I picked up the stuff. I don't know why the marker is still there, but uh, alright, let's get out of here. Oh fuck, another PK guy, man. These guys are all armored up. Get, what the fuck, man? Unbelievable. All you had to do was climb, bro. You sat there. Look, I took so much damage from, from like, nothing, man. Come on, let's heal. Thank you, let's go. There we go. <sighs> and we got another encounter over here. Oh, damn. What the hell is down here? Hag hunting grounds? Oh man. These fucking bandits. Alright, let's keep going here. Damn, I don't want to jump down there. Okay. <laughs> oh. The fuck is that? Is that a howler? Hmm. Right, we actually got a quest we can pick up here too. So there's no problem. You got a problem? A problem? Pilgrim, you gotta help me. I'm in deep shit. Real fucking deep. If you don't help me, that bald thug, my uncle, will beat me. And he's got hands like cast iron frying pans. The last time he hit me, I had a lump on my forehead as big as a horn. Uh, like some fucking rhino. And it came in rainbow colors, too. The horn, I mean. Damn, I mean... I guess I can help him. What did you do to make your uncle angry this time? Nothing yet, but I will in a moment. Like any normal person, I took a nap and then boom, I was asleep like a frog in a swamp in winter. The worst part is that the sausage is on the verge of rotting. In this day and age, throwing away good food is a crime. Okay, nearly good food, but it won't give you the shits quite yet. If it's eaten in the next hour, everyone will be fine. Okay, maybe one of them will run to the bathroom. Better than starving. After all, no one is shit so much they stop being hungry, right? But in three hours, everyone's asses will explode like shit geezers. Then comes the puking. 
My uncle would just fucking kill me, and the rest will feed my corpse to the infected. I'd hurry this food over to them myself, but I still have to prepare the smoker. This stuff doesn't make it. Well, you know what will happen. <laughs> yeah. We, uh, I heard you. I heard what, uh, I heard what you said, so. Yeah, where should I take Show it? me where to go. Jesus, you can't even imagine how important this is to me. Just grab the food rations on the table and hurry up to deliver them. Wait, is this like a challenge? Oh, okay, yeah, expira uh, expiration day challenge. Okay, all right, well, let's get back to the bazaar. And I believe we have a night quest here, too. But, uh... All right, let's, uh, let's keep going here. We'll do those challenges another time. But promise, I promise, so we will do them. I definitely want to get them done, so... Damn, dude. See ya! Fucking Bazaar is still over there, damn. Thought we were a lot closer. Really? Damn it. What the fuck, dude? Really? Come on. There we go. These virals, man. Dude. Why the viral? Look at it. Oh, dude. <laughs> you just throw a fucking rock at me? No way. Oh, yeah. See you later. Yeah, I'm not quite sure where the virals come from, but... I don't know, they kind of make it interesting anyway, so I'm not really hating on it. The quest giver over here. Yeah, we should go pick that up. I mean, we're probably not going to do it right yet, but um, I think it's better to already have them so we don't have to run around and pick them up. The essence of survival? What are you talking about? Want to find out? Just close your eyes. Why in the hell would I close my eyes? No, I'm not closing my eyes. No way. One of you might uh, stab me, for all I know. You bet she would. Oh, stop it, Diane. Really? Okay, so I gotta choose the other option then, whatever. The essence of survival? What are you talking about? Want to find out? Just close your eyes. What do you perceive? Oh, something stinks. Exactly. The smell. Impulses going straight from the senses to the limbic system, triggering an emotional response. Memories. The well-being of the mind. But, uh, that smells like... Well, that smells like shit. <laughs> what did you expect? <laughs> what do you think people use as fertilizers around here? Too much information. Sorry. I sure hope you don't mean smelling like shit is the essence of survival. Of course not. I have this really exciting idea for a new fragrance. People are going to pay a fortune for just a whiff. I called it Turn Me On. And it's almost finished. I just need some scraps for the heart note. A uh, heart note? Hmm. The middle note of the perfume. Metal scraps and lavender. That's all I'm missing. Oh, of course. Metal scraps and lavender. The obvious blend. Naira goes out of her way to be... Uh, controversial. If you bring me some, I'll tell you everything about my secret formula. Pretty sure I already yeah, have that she needs stuff. lavender for her perfume, too. Hmm. Now that makes more sense. Where's the Naira? Metal um, scraps. Naira wants them. Oh, I hope this isn't some wild goose chase. Making perfume out of metal? <laughs> Sounds absurd. 
I mean, I'm pretty sure I already have the stuff, so... Here, your, uh, ingredients. Mmm, good. I wish there was more oil on the metal scraps, but... Oh, Naira, can't you just be thankful for what you've got for once? She gives me this shit every day, I swear. Okay. Okay. Voila! It's ready. Here, smell it. <sighs> wow. It smells... It's... Oh, boy, it's like heaven. What is it? Silly little boy. Too young to know, aren't you? It's new car smell. A... A car? Are you disappointed? The scent of luxury is the bass note. The smell of confidence is the heart note. And the fragrance of risk and adventure is the head note. All you dream about is to turn it on and drive away into the distance. Thanks so much for helping me out. Unlike some people. Here, have this. I rubbed it with Turn Me On. This'll remind you to tune into your sense of smell now and then. Okay. Alright. Side quest completed. The essence of survival. A recipe for Turn Me On. What the hell does that do? <laughs> um, and a recipe. Damn, I don't know if it's here or what, but um, yeah, I don't think it's a weapon or anything. I don't know. That's weird. Okay, let's uh, question Sophie. Let's get back to the bazaar. Open that chest up, man. Haven't seen my kids in months because of this ridiculous blockade at the center. Dude. My wife was a nurse when this city was still called Bedor. Okay, so I guess I gotta go around. Damn. Hey, who the fuck are you? Easy, Chief. He ain't PK. How do you know? They're creeping around here all the time. He's that outsider, the pilgrim. What? He's from outside the walls. Well, fuck me. I don't know what brings you here, but watch your back, pilgrim, and stay away from the PKs. They ain't no one's friends. Okay. This time with a biomarker. Damn, I wonder who the fuck that was. Carl said if you show up to bring you round so he can introduce himself. What a nice change from wanting to hang me. And remember, humanity created a civilization that turned out to be a colossus on clay legs. We cannot make the same mistakes. He didn't want to, he had to. You were a threat to everyone. Of course. Do not listen to the ideologies preached by fools calling for reconstruction. There will be no rebuilding. Who would have thought? A pilgrim in the bazaar. Welcome. Yeah, I'm still alive, despite your best efforts. It's clear to me you're holding a grudge. But if you were in my shoes, you would understand. We are responsible for the safety of our community. And we treat this seriously. That's why we did what we did. I hope you can forgive us. So, pray tell. What's it like in the outside world these days? Man, I was about to say, why are you ask me really about that? I don't even know you. Anyways, you wanted me here for gossip. Yeah. Okay. Is gossip all you want from me, Carl? No. But you came from outside. And you're walking around my flock. So, to set things straight, I need to know if you're a sheep or a wolf. What are you then? Whoa. A sheep? I'm no threat to you. A wolf? You better watch out. 
Yeah, we'll go with neutral. I'm just gonna say I don't like that metaphor. Yeah, I'm not really a fan of this metaphor. Ah, oh, yes. I see. Pilgrims are not people of metaphors or poetry. They prefer to act. Yeah, about acting. I'm looking for Sophie. Are you? And why, pray tell? Oh, damn. Do I lie to him? Say I have a package for her? It's my own business. I'll just be straight up. I need to ask her about Lucas's death. Oh. Why would a pilgrim care about PK business? What's in it for you? Well, let's say a man's death should be another man's concern. Isn't that what separates us from the infected? I guess you have a point. Lucas's death is our concern as well. But mainly because we are the prime suspects. I have never hidden my views on the peacekeepers. The old world fell because of people like them. Greedy, power-hungry fascists. Building the new reality based on the old values would not be wise, to say the least. Of course, according to the PK, such claims automatically make me, and all of us, potential killers. So the sooner Lucas's murderer is found, the better for us. Go that way. You'll see a giant of a man. That's Herman, Sophie's bodyguard. She won't be far. But just to be clear, I'd be surprised if she knew anything about it. Sophie is a fighter, not an assassin. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. I'll see you around, Carl. Damn. Man, I don't want to end up drinking my own pee. Okay. Someone's got to do so something about it. So we got a question, situation. Sophie, about Lucas. Damn. Sophie, can we talk? Don't hurt him, Herman. Let him talk. Damn, some kind of bodyguard. My name's Aiden. You're that pilgrim that came to town recently. You're sure well informed. Don't have much of a choice. I'm in charge of safety here. Besides, yesterday you made quite an entrance. I'm looking for a job. Would you happen to know of any? Looking for a job? I only work with people I trust. You came from outside. They wanted to hang you. Nobody says anything good about you, Pilgrim. Do you want me to trust you? Talk to the people at the bazaar. See if you can gain their trust. If so, then it might persuade me to change my mind. Okay. So it looks like we're gonna have to earn her trust. Uh, get some work at the bazaar and earn Sophie's trust. All right. All right. Looks like we're going to have to end it here. But uh, hopefully you enjoyed that. I mean, I certainly did. And, uh, yeah, this playthrough, it's uh, it's a lot of fun. And I think, personally, the game has changed quite a bit. Uh, virals all over the place. Nighttime seems a little more terrifying. And, uh, yeah, I'm having, I'm having a blast with it. So uh, if you like what you saw, give it a like and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss the next one. And lastly... I just want to say thank you for watching, and until the next one, keep on gaming.